Christ, you retard. This better not be about what I think it's about. Oh, shit. <sighs> I'm going to my room. Come by later if you want to talk about it. Mm -hmm. What? Oh, I tell you, Jean, I feel it. Something is wrong. Perhaps Monsieur Winks spends the night with another guest. No, I have already cleaned Mademoiselle Buton's room, and where else could he have been? The American girl stays with her boss. As for the Lady Howard and Estelle... Hmm. Enough, Roxanne. Lock the door and touch nothing. We shall see if Monsieur Winks returns. Uh, uh, oui, Jean. Okay, Wilkes ist verschwunden. Okay, ich will mal ganz kurz lauschen, ob die anderen da sind. Mhm. Der schreibt irgendwas. I don't think anybody's in there. Okay, die sind nicht da. Madeleine ist da. I don't think anybody's in there. Emilio ist auch weg. <lacht> Gut. Dann will ich mal hier reingehen. Und die Dame befragen. Excuse me, Roxanne. Oh, Monsieur Knight. Do you need something? What's up this morning? I saw you talking to Jean. Oh, Monsieur. I am very afraid for Mr. Wilkes. This morning his window, it is wide open. And things in his room, they are not right. Usually, I find his night clothes on the floor, yes? But this morning, there is no sign of them, and his razor and toothbrush, they have not been used. It is as if he never got up this morning, yet he is not there. Gee, that sounds bad. Why don't you let me take a look? Uh, I, I don't know. Roxanne, this could be serious. Mr. Wilkes would want us to make sure he's not in any trouble. I agree. That is why I go to Jean. But he thinks I have the big, uh, imagination. Personally, I've learned never to underestimate a woman. <laughs> Monsieur. All right, I will show you. Follow me. Ciao, Please, Monsieur Knight. If Monsieur Wilkes returns, do not tell him I let you in, yes? I won't. Thanks. It's wide open, all right. Creepy. It reminds me of my dream. Es war also nur ein Traum, okay. I don't see any signs of forced entry on the window. I don't see any signs of... Okay. If someone did break in here... They apparently had no interest in the hotel stationery.
Wilkes's keys are still here, so he couldn't have left town. I don't need Wilkes's moped. Okay. That's his clothes, but where's his equipment? Nothing in there but dirty laundry. The bed looks slept in. The springs are a bit overworked, but other than that... Okay. Hey, that looks just like the one in our room. No clues in there. Wilkes's stuff is still here. Okay. The bed looks slept in. It's okay. Ja, keine Ahnung. Mir fällt jetzt nichts auf, außer dass er nicht abgereist ist. Vielleicht ist er ja irgendwie draußen irgendwo. Hm. Get in here. I'm listening. Well, I really did it this time. I knew it. You did, didn't you? Did you? Yeah. Key Rice. Ah, oh, come on. How about some support here? So what happened anyway? When she left here last night, she didn't want anything to do with you. Well, it was an accident. Right. You're the only guy I know who could accidentally end up in bed with the most beautiful woman for 50 miles. What about Madeline? What about Madeline? Shays. You know, you got kind of a reverse rose-colored glasses thing going on. Must be your fear of commitment affecting your optical nerves. Grace is beautiful. She's nice. She's smart. She's funny. You ought to have your head examined. And besides which, I ought to break your neck for hurting her feelings. Oh. Did you get a look at her face this morning? No, knock it off. I feel bad enough. I just don't know how to act. I mean... God, she's like my sister or something. Aw. Mm -hmm. Well, I suppose you could try to talk to her about your feelings, get it all out in the open. Nah. nah. I'll tell you what. Just pretend it never happened. Oh. Really? Just act like nothing happened. Try it. Okay. Na toll. Sie ist für eine Schwester für mich. Warum hat er dann mit ihr geschlafen? Das ist irgendwie sehr merkwürdig. I can't think of anything to talk to Mose about at the moment. Okay. Tschüss. Ha. Oh, ich kann da noch mal reingehen. Roxanne? Oui. Did you find any clues in the room of Monsieur Wilkes? Not exactly, but don't worry. We'll find him. Yes, Monsieur. I believe this has something to do with housework. Never used one myself. That's glaube ich gern. Nice ironing. But they could use some bleach. Look, Inspector. It was the med with the cleaning products in the supply room. Mm -hmm. Look, Inspector. Okay. 
Look, Inspector. Look. I believe it's a medieval torture device. <laughs> you must be confusing me with Roger Wilco. <laughs> it's for sitting on. You know, I prefer the view I get standing. Thank you. <laughs> you must be confusing me with Roger. And I thought the French maid in Clue had big um, uh, feather dusters. <lacht> okay, tschüss. Dann gehe ich mal wieder runter und werde mal gucken, wo Wilkes abgeblieben ist. Have you seen Wilkes yet, Jean? No, monsieur. Have you? No. Oh, I'm sure he'll be popping it up any time now. Okay. Das heißt für mich, Map abklappern. Okay. <lacht> Wir sehen uns gleich. Hm, okay. Hier ist was los. I think that's Lady Howard and Estelle's moped. Why would they stop here? This place isn't even interesting enough to have a tourist sign. Das ist ja deren Stelle, wo sie graben. Das wissen wir ja bereits. It looks like an empty plastic water bottle to me. It's got to be Estelle's. Lady Howard's lips have probably never touched plastic in her life. Oh, poor Estelle. She's kind of like a faithful bulldog, isn't she? <laughs> well, here's a scene of domestic bliss. Morning, ladies. Oh, it's you. What are you doing here? Oh, just passing by. I see you've narrowed down your theory. Really? Some people haven't the slightest consideration. It's all right, Lily. Bother. It is not. Do you mind, Mr. Knight? Estelle and I are on a private enterprise and we don't need any help or supervision from you. I wasn't offering any. Very well. Then be gone. Go on. Fish posh! <laughs> Fish posh! You must have a deep desire to humiliate me. Yes, indeed, I have. <laughs> oh, come in on my hair! Hmm, then, what I'm doing? Web abklappern. Oh, are here was? Okay. The tourist sign. Poo says tomb lookout. I wonder who's here. Yeah, Emilio Boy, when's this rote thing is. Remind me to put it in my will. I'd rather not be stuck in a sarcophagus at the side of the road. That's the tomb the sign mentions. Must be some famous person named Poo San. 
buried there. Kann man da hochgehen? Nee. That looks just like private property. I love it when it's that easy. Good thing they have those up, cause there's nothing more tempting to vandalize than a tomb on a hill. Huch! Wie ist er denn da jetzt hochgekommen? Oh! Hi! Wonder what Emilio's doing here. Hi, Emilio. Hello, Mr. Knight. So, what you doing up here? Uh, just looking for a quiet spot to meditate. Funny. Most people prefer Tour Magdala or Blanchefort to, uh, meditate. Do they? This location, too, has its benefits, you know. Mm-hmm. He's looking for some peace and quiet. I've never seen a more unsociable tour group in my life. Somebody wrote wuss. <laughs> Must have been looking at Moseley at the time. If there were two of those, I could make a fire. Als ob du ein Feuer machen könntest. Naja, gut. I have nothing to say to you. Oh, I think you do, Mr. Sinclair. Perhaps you had better come in. I've learned that you were, in fact, hired by Prince James. Good. But that doesn't excuse your prying into my affairs. You've destroyed my cover. See now, that's the problem with secrets and lies. It's impossible to tell which ones might be relevant until you dig them up and take a good whiff. That's between you and Prince James. But I can tell you that you're treading on thin ice. This is a delicate situation. You might find yourself in very hot water indeed. I'm getting confused. Am I supposed to watch out for thin ice or hot water? Very amusing, I'm sure. We'll see how your cavalier attitude serves you with the prince. Now what is it that you want? Hmm. I wanted to talk to you about your bloodline manuscript. How did you know about that? I followed you last night and dug it up. <laughs> you what? <laughs> This is outrageous. I hope you can appreciate my motivation. I was in the room when Prince James's son was taken. There's very little I wouldn't do to find him. I can't fathom why an outsider like you was hired in the first place. It's absurd. But now that you've seen my manuscript, I hope you finally comprehend that I am not the kidnapper. It's not incriminating in that regard, no. Where is the manuscript? You didn't remove it, did you? I didn't think it was good for it, being out in that damp ground and all. You must return it at once. Yeah, uh-huh, I will. But it's at the hotel at the moment, though. Mr. Knight, I suggest you bring it back here immediately. Because if anything happens to that manuscript, Prince James will be very displeased. I will, no problem. Prince James implied that the kidnapping was political. Would the manuscript have anything to do with it? It could. There are those who take exception to the idea of Prince James being on the throne. The throne? What throne? Never mind. The manuscript promotes Prince James as king of what? Scotland? Oh, it doesn't promote him as anything, per se. It simply lays out the genealogies. He's clearly the best candidate. Best candidate for what? 
Are you talking about Scottish independence? No. In our modern world, Scotland is a very small principality indeed. England? The Stuarts have vowed they'd never accept the English throne. Well, what then? It's not for me to say. Hm. Mit der heiligen Blutlinie und so. Könige von allem und jedem. Here's what I don't get. Why are you working on the manuscript here? Obviously, you don't need the Templar vibes. There's usually one of us in the area, just to keep an eye out. For what? Treasure hunters? For anything. But why you? There is a certain opposition to the manuscript. The work on it was to be done discreetly. And you figured they'd never suspect you'd work on it here. Something like that. Of course, you've quite destroyed my anonymity. Do you know Montreux, the owner of the local vineyard? I know of him, of course. It's a small area. Is he one of yours, by any chance? A Freemason? No. At least he's not Scottish right. Vielleicht die Gegner. He's not looking too happy today. Well, I could keep asking him stuff, but I have the feeling he wouldn't tell me anything. Okay, bye bye. I have to go. As you wish. Mm, hello? Ah! What are you doing? I was, uh, <laughs> I was just gonna talk to Grace, uh, but yeah, she's in the shower. And... Huh. So, uh, see ya. Mm -hmm. I'll catch up with you later. Monsieur Mosley. This place is a fruit bin. And the Zeitung put on the cloud or irgendwie was? This manuscript is weg. Der Arsch. Hat er uns einfach beklaut. Vielleicht noch was? Hm. I don't think I need to scan that into Sydney. Gucken, ob ich alle hab. Emilio habe ich nicht. Estelle habe ich noch nicht. Ja, okay. Estelle und Emilio. I think Grace can take a shower by herself. 
Ja, ja, okay. Okay. Das habe ich vorher nicht gesehen. Hm, that's a big old wilk size footprint. Oh shit. Uh, I found wilks. Der Tod? Oh Gott. Und in seinem Pyjama ermordet. Well, I guess that answers the question, what kind of PJs would a man like Wilkes wear? Poor bastard. They must have pulled him from his room last night, but no one heard a thing. How do they do that? And why Wilkes? Hat er ja irgendwas rausgefunden oder so? Poor bad. Poor bad. He's been completely drained. Just like the two dead Freemasons. It's from Wilkes to his publisher. He must have been worried about someone seeing it, so he took it to bed with him. Apparently he was right to be paranoid. Yeah, Mr. Rockelbank, I'm happy to report that Everything has gone even better than I had hoped. I confirmed not only the existence of the object, but found a group of caves that I think will provide access. I will take lots of pictures and maybe pop by. New York when I leave here, right? But I wanted to let you know that you can start clearing the calendar for my book. I think we should get get it out ASAP because there's lots of s snoops nosing around the thing this thing and I wanna be sure they don't beat us to it. Jay Wilkes. Okay, did irgendwas gefunden. Ein Objekt. Und ähm, jemand hat ihn dann deswegen umgebracht. Ist hier noch oh, okay, ja, hier ist noch was. Either the Red Cross had an accident here, or I found Wilkes's missing blood. I'd rather not, thanks. Aber ist halt wirklich irgendwie merkwürdig, wenn das Vampire sind und die das Blut dann aber irgendwie gar nicht. Knee indentations, just like at the armchair. God. Gar nicht brauchen. They held Wilkes here while they drained his blood. He wasn't exactly small either. Okay, ich will entweder Mosley oder Grace davon erzählen, denke ich. Äh, wenn ich denn weiß, wie ich zurückkomme. Grace! 
Crazy. Ich muss dir was erzählen. Crazy. Bonjour. Hey. Hm. Da ist doch irgendwas drin. Das ist auch das Manuskript, denke ich. Wenn ich nicht komplett bescheuert bin. Gracie, 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 Gracie. Hey, that girl's a worker, isn't she? Mm. She's a keeper. Guess what I found today? What? Wilkes's corpse. What? I found him at Lom Moor. Looks like they took him right out of his room last night. Oh my God. Creepy, isn't it? They were in the hotel. Weird, because I was dreaming about them. That's why I, um... Well, uh, how, how was Wilkes killed? Just like Prince James's men. Throat cut, blood drained into a pool. God. Ugh. What am I, cursed or something? I spent the entire day in the car with Mallory and McDougal, and then last night I had dinner with Wilkes, and... What was his big theory, anyway? He had a seismic survey done. They show hollow areas, and he had uncovered a big one. It makes sense, actually, because I've been working on this riddle called Le Serpent Rouge. Sure. You keep working on that. I've got some ideas of my own to follow up. <sighs> Fine. Er hört gar nicht richtig zu, der Blödmann. Did you check out the Bloodline manuscript? Yeah, pretty interesting. Where do you want me to start? Oh, wow. Um, chronologisch, wenn es geht. Hm. What's the manuscript say about the Bloodline? The Bloodline thing is major. The descendants of Jesus are called Disposini. Their symbol is the unicorn. Unicorn? Mm-hmm. Supposedly, the horn represents the male phallic symbol, and the unicorn itself represents the fertile Jesus. Well, no wonder the Catholic Church had a conniption. But is there any way this bloodland thing could be legit? Well, there's no reason why Jesus shouldn't have married and had children, unless you believe any kind of sex is a sin. Personally, I don't. And you certainly don't. That's just the land I feed Catholic girls, but go on. Uh-huh. <laughs> and it's the kind of thing the early church might have suppressed, if for no other reason than to make sure the bishops of the church had all the power and not the descendants. That explains how it might be possible, but it's hardly proof. True, but if it's all a myth, it's a very old myth. The royal arms of Scotland show a Davidic line of Judah... Disposenic Unicorn and the Jewish Fleur de Lis. So they've believed they were Disposenic from the Middle Ages at least. Uh -huh. Does Sinclair mention the Holy Grail in the manuscript? The Grail represents the bloodline and a kind of noblesse oblige duty to serve mankind. But also, remember what you heard on the train? You heard the kidnapper say San Grael. Yeah? The manuscript says the words Holy Grail were actually a mistranslation. The original phrase wasn't San Grael or Holy Grail, but Sang Real. Sang Real? What's that mean? Blood Royal or Royal Blood. The Holy Grail is the bloodline, Gabriel. That's what's so creepy. Wow. I wonder if that's what they were saying on the train. It's royal blood. That's what I've been wondering. Kind of brings the whole vampire theory back onto the playing field, doesn't it? Yeah. Is there, um, is there anything more in there about the unicorn imagery? Um, a bit. You know all those medieval tapestries that show a unicorn in a garden or a, a unicorn being hunted? Yeah. Supposedly, they all represent the disposony being suppressed by the church. Oh. Hmm, okay. What's the manuscript say about the Freemasons? 
The manuscript came right out and said that the original split between the Templars and the Priory of Sion was over the bloodline. The Priory wanted to support certain French families of Merovingian descent, while the Templars supported the emerging Stuart dynasty. I think it's pretty clear that the Freemasons and the Priory are still fighting over the same issue. Did you get the impression that the manuscript was trying to set Prince James up for something? It certainly went to great lengths about his pedigree. I guess the royal families find that terribly irrelevant. What about rulership? Did it mention anything about a throne? Yeah, actually. It talked about the European Union a lot. How any system of government ideally has both a parliament and a monarchy. You don't think they're trying to... No. No, no, no. Position the House of Stuart as monarchs over the EU. Yeah, I think that's exactly what they're trying to do. Oh, God. No wonder Sinclair is hiding out here. I'm still not sure I see the connection between Sinclair and Prince James's men. The manuscript did mention Prince James. It, it traced the various branches of the bloodline all the way down to the present day. It was obviously making the point that the Stuarts have the largest, purest amount of the blood, and Prince James is mentioned as the current Stuart heir. That doesn't sound like a moped. Hmm? Damn! It's Prince James! Where's the manuscript? Uh -oh. I've got to get it back to Larry before he runs to his boss and complains. It was right here. I left it on the table when I went to take my shower. Ooh, don't tell me that, Grace. Grace? Somebody must have taken it. Shit. Okay, let me think. It's about time I pinned down our old squirmy friend from the NOPD. I'll get him out of town for a bit. What about Prince James? Tell him I'm working on the case. I can't see him till I've got that manuscript or he'll have my head on a platter. You really think Mosley? Yeah, mm -hmm. the bum. But do me a favor and look around here, just in case I'm wrong. Leave me the bike, will you? You can ride with Mosley. What? Come on, how can I keep an eye on the others if you leave me stranded? Please? I don't believe this. Thanks. God! Gracie. Okay. Haben wir noch irgendwas, was wir einscannen müssen? Nein. Okay, dann müssen wir das Rätsel weitermachen. Nein, ich bin zu doof. This riddle is fascinating. You can almost see what it's hinting at. I really want to solve it. Le serpent rouge. New email. Oh. Uh. Temple of Solomon. Ach, das ähm, wieder aufgebaut ist der Tempel. Okay. Holy of Holies. Ähm, das Allerheiligste ist ein Viertel der Länge. Dann haben wir unten auch nochmal ein Viertel. Und der Rest ist Sanctuary, Sanctuary, okay. Sanctuarium, oder keine Ahnung. Um. Close. Uh. Three is the Trinity and the separation of the spheres. The three which are the four are the divisions of the temple. I began my journey in the shadows and completed it in the light. I had marked the site at last, there in the center of the most sacred space. At the summit of the mountain, the place stood out in the brilliance of the midday sun. It was guarded by the three knights' towers, the rooks, on the circuit of the divine horsemen of the abyss. 
I wonder if the Temple of Solomon was what the Templars were building underground. The rectangular shape on my map seems to match the temple diagram, mm -hmm. but Scorpio says the divisions are important. I should try to mark them out. Yeah, ja, a viertel, a viertel, and the the rest. Okay. Um, ich muss mal ganz kurz niesen. Ein Moment. Okay, Entschuldigung. Um, Meine Map. Okay. Das hier in der Mitte ist der Tempel. Die drei, die die vier sind. Also wir hatten hier ein Viertel, da ein Viertel und der Rest ist irgendwie die Mitte. Aber warum die drei, die die vier sind? Ach so, vier Viertel. Eins, zwei, drei, vier. Aber es sind nur drei Bereiche. Okay. Äh... Enter points. Uh. Ja. Glaube ich. Also ich bin mir eigentlich schon sehr sicher. That's it. Ja. The divisions of the temple. That's Aha. the porch down by Lebec. Then the middle is the sanctuary. And the third part in the north must be the Holy of Holies. Das war mal ein Teil, den ich leichter äh, lösen konnte. Ja. Und jetzt? Let's see. I had marked the site at last, there in the center of the most sacred space. We're ready to mark the site. Hmm? Center of the sacred space? Yeah, but den haben wir doch schon, oder nicht? Oder meint sie Holy of Holies? Ich bin verwirrt. Das? The center of the Holy of Holies. Okay. I think that's the site. It's on Mount Cardu. I'll write down the coordinates. Mm, okay. The site. Okay. At the window of the ruined house, I looked across the trees denuded by autumn. Close to me, a presence, its feet in the water, like one who has just received the mark of baptism. I recalled the inscription, et in Arcadia ego, blank, blank, blank. Through some selfish inspiration, I found the missing three. The dust settled, and I saw at last. Curses, I know the truth. He is there, dead. The broken bread lies forgotten beneath the altar. I found the missing three letters. Sum. I have a feeling that's not all, though. The Serpent Rouge talks about dust settling. In crossword puzzle lingo, that implies there's an, an anagram in here somewhere. I should try to analyze it. Oh, an anagram? Wie soll ich das denn wissen? Uh. Das ist ja richtig hardcore. Ach nee, ich muss das andere aufmachen. Äh. Ja. Ich bin verwirrt. Ich 
Okay. Wie soll ich jetzt das Anagramm machen? I have no idea. Ach du großer Gott. Das nimmt ja gar kein Ende hier. Und ich soll jetzt aus der ganzen Liste Wörter aussuchen, die dann irgendwie was ergeben sollen. Ja, geil. Oh. <lacht> Das kann ja alles sein. Ich meine, das muss schon irgendwie zur Story passen mit Jesus und der Blutlinie oder sowas. Aber... Ich bin auch in Akkadien. Es könnte der Tod sein, könnte aber auch Jesus sein oder so. Sag mal, ist irgendwann auch mal Schluss hier, oder? <lacht> oh Mann, das wird ja immer schwieriger. Dankeschön. Select words to move over to the phrase building area. Ich habe erstens keine Ahnung von Latein. Das heißt, wie ein Satzaufbau ist, weiß ich schon mal nicht. Und das sind ja hier, keine Ahnung wie viele scheiß tausend Wörter. Oh. Temple, Sanctuary. Keine Ahnung. Tomb? Klingt gut. God oder so. Ziel klingt auch gut, aber oh, keine Ahnung. Gibt es hier keinen Jesus? Hm.
Das Grab Gottes äh, ist hier oder sowas? Keine Ahnung. I touch vielleicht. Ähm. Falsch. Origin of word is Greek? What? I touched oh the my tomb god. Of god Jesus. I mean, oh my god. Okay. Das heißt, Arkadien gab es oder gibt es und dort ist das Grab von Jesus. Okay. Okay. But the worst is yet to come. How many have pillaged the house, using the most sacred for purposes most foul? I turn north. Facing me, I see unwinding endless by its coils, the enormous red serpent mentioned in the documents, rigid and bitter. The huge unleashed beast at the foot of the white mountain becomes scarlet with greed and drunk with stolen and profane communion. Deliver me out of the mire. Also den weißen Berg haben wir hier ja auch. Und einen roten Berg gibt es ja auch. Aber ich weiß jetzt nicht genau. Turning to the north. Okay, that must be north of the site. I see the red serpent rigid and bitter. Must be talking about some kind of landmark feature. Turning to the north. So, ich muss wieder auf die Karte wahrscheinlich. Ähm Turning to the north. Rock Negre. Hier ist doch irgendwo dieser rote Berg, oder? Das ist doch hier bei Rocknecker irgendwo. Hier irgendwo, oder nicht? Das ist doch bei Blanche vor. Da gibt es einmal Rocknecker und wenn man dann bei Blanche vor mit dem Fernglas irgendwie sich umsieht, dann hat man einmal diesen weißen Berg und einmal so einen roten Berg. Aber hier ist irgendwie nichts. Ich habe keine Ahnung. Ich mache jetzt einfach mal random, weil ich keine Ahnung habe. Hier irgendwo oder so. Huh. 
nichts gefunden. Das finde ich aber doof. Gar nichts. Nix gefunden. Also hier ist ja glaube ich irgendwie was. Weiß nicht, ob das was bringt. Aber eigentlich denke ich, dass es das auch da unten irgendwie ist. Oh. Muss ja hier irgendwo sein, oder nicht? That's it. That's the red serpent. That is weird. It must point out something. I mean, yeah, ja, it sieht aus wie eine Schlange mit dem Kopf da. Aber ich dachte eigentlich, dass das von von der Orientierung her halt nicht da oben ist, sondern hier irgendwo. Oder das, was ich gesehen habe, diesen dieser rote Berg. Der gehört gar nicht dazu. Das ist irgendwie was ganz anderes. Kann auch sein. Aber es würde halt passen, weil das halt so ein roter Dings war. Hm. I am aware of the scent of the perfume which impregnates the sepulchre of the one I must release. Cursing the profane in their ashes. And those who follow their ways, returning from the darkness while making the gesture of horror at the abyss into which I had plunged. Here is the proof that I knew the secret seal of Solomon and I had visited the secret places of the queen who watches over the king. Take heed, my friend. Do not add or take away one iota. Think and think again. The base lead of my words may contain the purest gold. Let he who has the understanding use it with wisdom. I want to take a break from Le Serpent Rouge for a while. Ja, danke schön. Vielen Dank, das sehe ich nämlich auch so. <lacht> oh, mein Gehirn ist matsch. Mit der roten Schlange fand ich trotzdem irgendwie komisch. Mhm. Mhm. Hm, hm. 